from mysteries of our universe to enigmas that have left the most intelligent people scratching their heads. Here are 12 mysteries that science cannot explain. Hey guys, this is your host, American Eye. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy that video. Number 12. Why do people sleep? Of course, most people will answer that it's because they are tired, but you might be surprised that the answer really isn't all that simple. Scientists have tried diligently to figure out why people sleep and have conducted various experiments to learn more about this alternate state of the human brain. Scientists really can't seem to put together a lot of specific answers about how creatures began to specifically pass out for hours on end. Some feel as though in the beginning of times, those who could effectively go into sleep mode could avoid predators and conserve precious energy. Although it's only been recorded in a few cases, scientists are beginning to believe in the possibility of there being a short sleeper mutated gene. This could actually affect less than 1% of the human species. Historical figures such as Napoleon Bonaparte, Leonardo da Vinci, and Margaret Thatcher have all reported only needing 4 or less hours of sleep per day. There's no way to know if they have the mutation, but more research on this gene and sleep in general is needed. Number 11. Resist Bone Breaks this might be well under 1%, and we don't recommend you trying this to see if you have it or not. Scientists are completely baffled by this mutation. According to Yale Medicine, a disclosed family in Connecticut who chose not to identify themselves has extremely high bone density to the point where it's impossible to break them. It's said that if they wanted to, they could withstand a collision with a train and walk away with only flesh wounds. Although they probably aren't going to try this, you get the picture. They seem to have found a gene that creates extremely dense bones to the point where they cannot be broken. Yale hopes this to be an important discovery and hopes to mimic the effects for cures and drugs in the future. Hopefully they don't create some type of genetic experiment that results in indestructible humans. Number 10. Star Jelly A spooky phenomenon known as Space Jelly seems to be some type of extraterrestrial, foul-smelling goo from out of this world. That's because that's exactly what it seems to be. It's often found after meteor showers, but quickly vanishes. It tends to swell up like a sponge after a rainstorm and can cause illness to those who touch it. Some speculate that that's why it's hard to do tests on this substance. It's believed by quite a few people that this jelly does contain cellular organic material that floats around through space. One DNA analysis at the Natural History Museum in London confirmed that the matter belonged to a frog. But what exactly would have happened to the frog in order for it to look like this? And why does it always seem to pop up after a meteor shower? Number 9. Why We Yawn Yes, of course, we realize people yawn when they're tired or bored from watching videos on the riches. But this is another bodily reaction that scientists just can't seem to figure out. Many theories have come out, but it's unclear what its original purpose is. When we are bored or tired, some believe that a yawn will provide your body with extra oxygen. They also notice that people's lungs expand larger when they're yawning than normal, which would sort of help support this theory. However, in an experiment where people were given oxygen, they still showed signs of yawning. Others feel as though yawning is essential for breathing, and without it, your lungs wouldn't properly function. You need to be coated with a certain oil-like substance called surfactant. Another mystery about yawning is why it's so contagious. You probably remember before seeing one of your colleagues yawning, which then made you do it. No one knows exactly why this happens, and what makes it even stranger is that you're more likely to yawn if you see your best friend yawn, or someone you like. Number 8. Dark Matter as you look up into space during nighttime, all you see is darkness from above. You might think that it's all just empty space, right? Not exactly. You could be looking at one of the most mysterious things science can't explain. We all know it's there, because it isn't not there, if that makes sense. It's used as glue to keep planets together and even galaxies from floating apart. Albert Einstein was the first to realize that space wasn't just completely empty space and dark matter was lurking around. NASA theorizes that large amounts of dark matter are protruding from Earth like you see here. It's basically easier to say what dark matter isn't than what it is, which is a mystery. Number 7. Why is 90% right-handed? This is one of those simple questions your kids might ask, but you may never even know the true answer because scientists don't even know. What is it about our right hand, and why does it always seem to be the most commonly dominant hand and not the left? We all have two hands, we figure the chances would be 50% lefty or 50% righty. It's hard to measure exact statistics around the world of handedness, but you probably remember even as far back as elementary school that most people are right handed. Some scientists have tried to relate left handedness to brain trauma while still in the womb. However, further research has proven that there isn't a ton of difference between the brains of people who are right handed and the brains of people who are left handed. 
In nature, primates tend to choose just one hand and stick with it. They might just seemingly prefer to use one hand over the other in order to perform different tasks. Once this hand is repeatedly used, it gains experience in handling certain tasks from a young age. Number 6. Where is intelligent life? Even on Earth, it might occasionally be difficult to find intelligent life forms. We mentioned before in previous videos where alien life could exist and small traces of extraterrestrial bacteria have been found. But are there some aliens out there curious about Earthlings and are self-conscious? It seems to be an answer that scientists and some of the richest people in the world are trying to figure out right now as we speak. A project known as Breakthrough Listen considers itself to be the largest ever scientific program to find more research on the existence of extraterrestrial beings. A total of 1 million exoplanets are going to be scanned in the Milky Way and beyond. It's looking to pick up any types of signals such as fast radio bursts, lasers, and other space stuff. We got Mark Zuckerberg and Russian billionaire Yuri Milner working behind it at the moment. So let's just wait and see what happens. Number 5. Cow's Magnetic Compass Utilizing Google Earth, scientists confirmed a strange theory about cows always facing either north or south while eating or drinking. It's found in all corners of the Earth, whether it's in Africa or here in the US. It doesn't matter which way the wind is blowing, whether they're tired or sad. It cows seemingly have some type of internal compass which makes them do this. If you ever get lost, maybe you should find a cow to help you out? They seem to be aligning themselves with Earth's magnetic field, which is kind of creepy in a sense. Do cows know something we don't, or do aliens implant them with some type of device in order to help them navigate? And that's why so many get abducted? Scientists haven't for sure pinpointed anything like a chemical that is sensitive in the cow to magnetism or anything like that. So this one certainly remains a mystery as to how they know. Number 4. Why do we dream and what do they mean? You might wake up in the morning after a strange dream takes over your consciousness, but have you ever stopped to wonder why we dream and what it might mean about you? You probably think you're totally crazy after some dreams and it's normal. Famous psychologist Sigmund Freud has spent years trying to analyze dreams and see if they can help us learn about ourselves. It's fairly well understood that dreams can symbolize things deep into the human psyche, but no one ever really knows why. Freud, of course, felt as though the dreams were related to repressed sexual desires and pretty much everything you dream about has something to do with that. It's an important thing for scientists to better understand dreams clearly, especially since more and more people are being diagnosed with PTSD. Number 3. Different Blood Types Humans have many different types of blood. There's O, A, AB, then there's RH negative. But the reason we have many different types of blood seems to be nothing less than a total mystery. Some believe the reason is due to our immune systems. Different types of blood seem to have more resistance against certain diseases. For example, O blood, which is more commonly found in Africa, seems to be better fitted for fighting off malaria. Since the blood cells are different, it's possible that they've actually evolved in order to make them more resistant to certain diseases that people are exposed to. The RH negative blood, which is even more of a mystery, doesn't even contain the rhesus protein, which is a protein that's still left over after humans evolved from apes. So if they don't have this protein, does that make them not human? People with RH negative blood are apparently more often than not people with green or blue eyes and reddish hair. Does this mean the whole country of Ireland could have extraterrestrial origins or what? Number 2. Giant Skeletons According to detailed Paiute legends, a group of red-haired giants inhabited northwest Nevada in close proximity to where petroglyphs were found. These giants were also known to be cannibals that would relentlessly attack the Paiutes and they ate them. In an area known as Lovelock's Cave, miners working here apparently discovered the mummified remains of extraordinarily large skeletons in 1911. Some people actually believe this was a hoax in order to develop tourism here. Paleontologists found an extremely large amount of mammoth and bare bones in the caves only 100 miles away. Mummies were discovered in 1940 in the Spirit Cave in Stillwater Mountains. The remains are approximately 9,400 years old, making it the oldest mummy found in North America. The mummy was found in a fur blanket and may have died from a fractured skull. Number 1. Ghosts According to a recent poll, roughly 48% of people believe in ghosts in the US. So could all those people be wrong? That's about 150 million people in the US and more than half of women here are also believers too. Although it certainly takes more than just a belief in order to make something exist, there have been ghost stories since the times of the ancient Egyptians. Those who are firm believers of ghosts feel as though what we see is actually from unused energy by a person who's lost their life in an unexpected manner. This is why more places where crimes are committed are said to be haunted. Others actually believe ghosts are from a mild hallucination caused by unknowingly inhaling carbon monoxide. Whatever the case may be, don't try doing that and see if it works.